So where's the food spot? Okay, it's just up and uh, to our left a little bit. Sprint some more. Just up here and to the left a little, I thought, right? So, oh, that actually kind of scared me a little bit. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> so let's lock on and... Hello, the world! Welcome back to episode number two of my Let's Play of Final Fantasy XV for the PC. Again, I, I can't express how excited I am for this game. I've been waiting for it for so long. Um, so I don't want to chat and, like, blabber on too much. So let's just go ahead and get right into it, shall we? All right, so kicking up exactly where we left off, of course. Um, yeah, we're... Uh, we're we just did our first quest. I tried out first person mode towards the end of last episode and it was uh, it was a little disastrous. I couldn't tell what the heck was going on. Um, so I went back to third person mode, which is fine. Um, I've never really been a true fan of first person anything. Um, it's kind of cool in concept, but in practice, it's a video game. Like I get the idea of immersion, but I like being able to see more if I can see more. Um, if the game allows me to see more, I will see more. So we're going to stick it in third-person mode and leave it there uh, unless I unless I want to try something else. But uh, we are here. We finished the first quest. We found our first campsite, um, and we are going to camp uh, so that we can apply the experience points, as you can see on the screen. Camp at Havens to enjoy a status-boosting meal and a good rest to tally experience. What will you do? Uh... Oh, okay, so you can camp, train, wait till morning, or wait until nightfall. Oh, because different quests are available at different times of day. All right, so we're just going to go ahead Let's and do a regular a camp. Day. All right, I'm going to pitch the tent. Okay, so we've got our report card for the area is A on time, C in finesse, and A plus in offense. Cool. Looks like Prompto likes taking pictures. That's right, and Ignis cooks, and Gladiolus does the uh, heavy lifting, I guess, of making our Coleman tent. <laughs> All right, so here we can select uh, Ing Ignis uses ingredients to prepare meals at camp, acquire new recipes to expand Ignis' cookbook, and the variety of bonuses available. All right, so we can make some toast, which increases our attack by 10. Uh, rice balls is HP by 50. Attack by 30 for croquet, madame. Um, increases, wow. Look at this crispy pizza, holy crap. Increases attack by 100, enables sprinting without expending stamina, and it's poison proof. Wow. Pizza is amazing. Crispy cheese pizza is like the greatest thing in the world. Yeah, um, why wouldn't I choose the crispy pizza? That just seems silly. <laughs> Unless I guess it expends, it expends all of our ingredients, and I should have used it later, but that's okay. That looks really good. I'm actually, like, starving right now. I might have to actually take a break after this episode, too, so that I can eat now. Oh, yay! Ba -da 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 -da. I love that sound. It was, like, my ringtone for the longest time. Um... All right, so we had that, um, the bonus from the food, uh, 69 experience points, um, and 14 AP applied. So if I hit A here, let's see what happens. Okay, next. All right, so we're almost to level two. I guess I probably could have uh, gone and battled a little bit more, which we'll probably do here shortly. I, I do need to get much better at, um, at battling in general and working as a team, because uh, I'm, I'm just not used to this combat system since this is my first time playing this game. 
All right, Prompto's photography. Oh, so these are our individual um, skills. So Noctis is fishing, Gladiolus is survival, Ignis is cooking, and Prompto's photography. Prompto is documenting the journey and pho photographs, review the pictures he takes, and save his best snapshots. Of course he'd take that picture. <laughs> All right. Um, that's kind of funny. That's not a bad picture. That could be better. <laughs> Nailed it. Why can't I warp too? So unfair. <laughs> These bastards were a pain. Yeah, they were. All right, and that's all of them. All right, so let's save. I think I'm gonna save that one. How do I save it? One is save. Save this photo. Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay. All right, let's go. <clears throat> Trouble you a moment, Noct. Yeah? I could use your help in the morning. Me and mornings don't usually get along. Might if you help me make breakfast. Sure. Why not? Most important meal. Well then, tomorrow it is. Tomorrow it is then. Access the pause menu outside of dungeons and combat to save manually. Oh, escape. Yeah, okay. Your friend has invited you on a tour. Join him at dawn tomorrow to undertake. You must remain in the vicinity of your destination. Okay. The key is to let the pot simmer without ever letting it burn. How do I do that? A few stirs here and there should suffice. I'm going to stir a pot. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I was literally just talking about how I'm hungry, and now the game is literally making me cook fake food. I mean, it's real food for them, but... Stir the pot with ASDW, blah, 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 don't let it burn. When was the last time you cooked anything? Um, too long ago to remember. Back don't let it burn. Cook. Sounds right. But even back then, I was pretty much just winging it. <laughs> Hardly what I'd call cooking, I imagine. Just what normal people would. Okay. Oh, let's see how things are stewing. Hmm. Could use just a touch longer to thicken. If you don't mind stirring. Alright, so I'm just, like, randomly button smashing. Button mashing. Here. Not at all. If you don't mind telling me what this cooking class is all about. No. I was only hoping to have a fireside chat. See what's got you stewing. So you cooked up this little pretense. All okay. these years. Never stop worrying about me. My royal duty, per His Majesty. Your hobby. Okay, I'm still no, stirring. Come on. Time for the taste test. Hmm. Looks done to a turn. Excellent work. Taste for yourself? He didn't taste it. Oh, there we go. Hmm. Sweet are the fruits of one's own labor. Not half bad. You must be eager to learn more of the gunnery arts. Actually, I'm eager to leave the cooking to you. My <laughs> half-baked scheme, up in smoke. How did you fancy returning to the stove? Can't complain. It's not so bad every once in a while. Just not first thing in the morning. No, no. The world at dawn is full of wonders. Yeah, can't wait to marvel at them all. Dawn tomorrow, <laughs> I'll marvel at my own pace. Yeah, right? You were a big help. Yeah, I'm good like that. Right. Do we get anything for that quest? Or is it just... Okay, earn 20 AP. Very nice. Very nice. Alright, it's auto-saving. Okay, alright, and our party's up. Okay, so, cool. Alright, let's, um... I want to go and battle some more stuff. Um, actually, let's take a look at... Oops here. Um, I want to... Oh, no. Not here. Um, Elemancy. Yep. Craft spells. Okay. 
So, magical fl Oh, I don't have any magical flasks. Oh, I have one magic flask. Okay. So... So, I can increase how much... Um... Elemancy I make out of these. I think I'll wait a little bit longer um, until I have like more elemental energy and uh, I probably need to buy more flasks too. So there's that. All right. Woohoo! Boink. Okay. So um, we do need to return back, um, but I want, I really want to battle some more stuff first. So let's see what direction are we going in. All right. Yeah, let's. All right. Okay. Oh, we've got those bonuses at the bottom. I think those are the those are the bonuses that we're seeing. All right. Oh, look, there's some monsters over there. Let's go get them. How do I unsprint? Oh. Okay, there we go. All right. Yep. That works. I get it. Heads up. And F. Bam! Oh wait, Noctis can instantaneously warp strike a targeted enemy at a cost. Uh, the farther he blade warps, the more damage. I did not know that. That's cool. Yeah, I hear you. Okay. Stay on your feet. All right. Okay. Bam! Warp strike away. Uh, when Noctis runs out of MP. Oh, I did run out of MP. Oh, okay. Ooh, dang. Oh, no. Okay. Nope, nope. Okay. Alright. Let's warp strike away and uh, recover MP, shall we? Because I'm in status. Stasis. There we go. Come on. My pleasure. Get my MP up. There we go. Oh, and we finished the battle. Okay. Got 47 MP, or Onward. XP. Right. That has picked up a potion. All right. Let's keep going. Yeah, those are our bonuses in the bottom middle of the screen, it does look like. All right, I want to keep Roman and uh, see if I can find some more monsters. The next time I camp, I want us to level up one or two times, so let's see if we can find another monster or two. So in the future, you know, as the game progresses more, um, I do not want to show you guys a lot of the grinding if I can, so I might cut some of this out in later episodes. Um, yo, okay, where are... Obviously, we need to head back that way at some point, but... Where are the monsters? Easy mode, yeah, okay. Difficult hunts. There's a monster over there, but I don't know what level they are. Remember. Oh crap. All right, level two saber tusks. That's what I was waiting for. All right. Looks like they're getting easier. That wasn't bad. Oh, oh. Nice, he's singing the, the theme that I like. Okay, there we go. This sounds like you're having fun. Very nice. We're already at 75 experience to uh, to gather up. All right. So, we've got... Uh, we do have another quest, but we're not level 5 yet or even remotely close. Um, so I don't want to do it just yet. Um... Let's check out some of these other spots. Food spot, food spot, um, and then there's a treasure spot up north. Um, let's check out some of the food spots first, which are behind us. Huh. Yeah. Let's head this way. Oh yeah, we can still sprint. Um, so at the bottom, it looks like there's a timer for the uh, for the bonuses that we got from eating that pizza. So I want to take full advantage of that. Um, as long as the timer is still available, oh, nice, yeah. then I can sprint without yeah. lowering any stamina. Um, we get attack bonus, and we can't be poisoned. 
So where's the food spot? Okay, it's just up and uh, to our left a little bit. Sprint some more. Just up here and to the left a little, I thought, right? So... Oh! That actually kind of scared me a little bit. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> so let's lock on and... Oh, we can actually see they're allergic to guns, daggers. Oh, so I should really equip my daggers when I'm attacking them. So daggers is uh, three for me. So let's attack daggers and let's do a warp strike. Bam. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, they're dying way quicker now with the daggers in place. That was very nice. Very, very nice. Okay. Right. Alright, so we should be right on top of these. Um, so we're looking around for something. I don't know what it looks like. I don't I don't really know what I'm looking for. Um, but it's a food spot, so I assume there's gonna be like something sparkly on the ground for me to pick up. Should be here somewhere. Oh no, it's to our left still, okay. Yeah, it's still to our left. So it's up here somewhere. Oh, there's something. There we go. All right. Oop. <clears throat> Pick up. Fossil wood. Is that what the thing was? No, that wasn't it. That was just something here. So I, need, I still need to turn left. It should be over here still, I guess. Oh, the music changed. It's kind of scary. Alright, to the right a little bit, this way. I don't know what food spots are and what that actually means. That music is really, really eerie though. I don't know, I don't know if I'm a fan of this. Alright, I should be like, it's like right here. Unless this is it. This... Oh, really? Really? Okay. Yep, I, I gotcha. Oh, crap. Oh, great. Wanna put some heads in? No, I'm oh, in. Yeah, okay. Ooh, head back. There's a point warp over there. And go! Okay, that was easy. So this must be the food spot. It has to be. Oh wait, it's right here. Yeah, is this it? Pick up. Yep, green peas. Very nice. Pick up. And pick up. Okay, so that was the food spot. Very cool. Is this a fishing spot right here, I wonder? Like, can I fish in this? I don't even know if I know how to fish yet. Eh, it doesn't look like it. Oh. Okay, a little bit of lag there. Alright, how do I get out of here? Like, it looks like I'm stuck, doesn't it? I guess I could maybe warp point out, maybe? Can I warp point out? <laughs> Yeah, how do I get out of here? Uh-oh. <clears throat> okay. So let's check out up here. <laughs> Can I, like, climb up out of here? Ah, there we go. Alright, that worked. That worked. Alright, are they gonna follow me? Maybe? Uh, maybe? All right, there they are. Cool. All right, let's um, let's go ahead and start heading, our, making our way back. Oh, perfect. That's what I was hoping for. Shift. Let's do an F. Nice warp strike there. There we go. All right, let's keep going. Gladiolus picked up a potion. Very nice. I still haven't had to use any potions, but uh. 
it's good to know that I'm picking them up, you know? Okay. Let's, uh... I guess we could go ahead and head back to the camp. We did... Oh, I should have, like... While we were over there, I guess... Yeah, there was that, um... Yeah, there was the other, um... Food spot that I should have checked out. For, uh, tomatoes. Yeah, let's go ahead and head back. Let's, let's, let's find the tomatoes first, too. I know, I know. I'm all over the place. Sorry, guys. Um... Where was it? North and then east. Yeah, let's find the other food spot. I'm fairly confident that we can uh, that we'll be fine with any of these battles. Hot. Then lose the jacket. <laughs> really? Oh, there we go. And that's what I'm hoping for too, right? So Yeah, it looks like is uh, more battles to level up some more, right? Oh wow, I didn't even realize there were more. Oh, 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 get up, get up. Okay. Alright, and I'm actually not doing a lot of teamwork stuff yet, which I keep forgetting about. Um, but uh, we'll, uh, I'll work on that. I gotta remember to be paying attention to that uh, technique bar thing. Alright. So, uh, if I keep going this way, there should be another foodie spot over here. Let's try not to fall into the canyon again. Should be just over here. Should be just to the east. I thought. Okay. Yeah, we should be like right on top of it. Should be. Oh, there's scorpions over here. That's exciting. I wonder what level the scorpions are. I have no idea. Can I do a save now? Save your file? Yeah, let's save here. Just in case. Shall we? I mean, it is auto-saving pretty frequently, so that's kind of nice, but, uh, I really w Okay. Man, is this... Where's that food spot? Yep, it's, like, right in front of us. It's, like, right over here. Oh, they found us already. That was very quick. Okay. And I still can't lock onto them yet. Guys, we... I still can't lock onto over them. Here. There we go. Bam. Okay, they're actually not... They're not too bad. They're only level one. <clears throat> there we go. Do a couple warp strikes. Let's, um... Oh, jeez. Alright, next time weight comes up, I want to do... Ah, dang it. I need to see him better. There we go. I want to find out what he's weak to. Um... Weak to regular swords and great swords. So let's switch up and do better damage. There we go. Look at that. Very nice. No use hanging around here. Indeed. Oh, and I can see the um, the food spot is right up here. There it is. Tomatoes. Is that it? Okay. More tomatoes. Perfect. Maybe we can still have some more pizza when this is all said and done. <clears throat> Alright, let's go ahead and head back now. We'll head back. We'll turn in this, um, this uh, Howling Wind of Hunger quest. And uh, we'll also talk to Cindy, since Cindy has our main quest line. Um, and we'll start, yeah. we'll start that process. I want to say if we head back to where we started pushing the car, then there might be more stuff to pick up. Any plan of nope. All right, saber tusks. Uh, let's uh, switch up to that to daggers, and attack right, with daggers. <clears throat> no Can't stop there we 
go. Alright. Sweet. Let's keep going. Back to it. Right. I think I'm starting to get a hang of certain things with weight mode turned on. I do like weight mode turned on because it gives you more options, especially the Libra ability, the Libra skill, to where you can find out what their weaknesses are. <clears throat> so that's pretty nice. Yeah. Um, so I'll probably leave weight on now. Um, originally, I wasn't really feeling it, but I think it I think it makes sense to keep it on, at least for now. Wah! All right, Prompto, get out of my way then. All right, let's go in here. We're back at Hammerhead. Let's get up the shop. Yeah, let's do it. We'll talk to Cindy first since we're here. She ain't gonna be ready for a while. Y'all need something? Ask for a discount, sure. A uh, bit steep for a simple tune-up, don't you think? Oh, now I get it. This must be what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them boys a lesson. Told me he ought to have y'all take care of some ornery varmints that have been causing a ruckus around here. I'd be happy to pay y'all for your services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? All right, eliminate the pests. Thanks so much for finding an easy way out. Thanks a lot, Papa. And we got 10 AP. Um, oh yeah, the Ascension menu. I am going to take a look at that, just not quite yet. Um, I want to investigate a little bit further through third-party resources um, to determine what um, what things t are best to get early on. Um, but you can look. Here's a combat Ascension tree, teamwork, stats, exploration, and even in weight mode, there's uh, some additional things. So like this one is uh, no mercy, boost damage inflicted by a scanned enemy's weakness. Uh, warp ambush during weight mode warp strike an enemy not targeting Noctis to increase the likelihood so like literally weight mode even has its own like good stuff um, and then there's magic of course so elementalism absorb more energy from elemental deposits like that seems pretty valuable right um, so I am going to investigate further what are the best things early on in the game to uh, invest points into, um, but I just don't know what that is yet, and I don't want to waste points so that we can get the most out of the game. Um, so I'll do that but shortly. Don't go running around after dark. The demons are liable to rip y'all to shreds. Oh, we got a bronze bangle. This ought to be enough for and a thousand gil. Just between us, though. Don't tell Papa. All right, except we're not going to actually stay somewhere because we can just camp out and it'll be better. All right, so we've got eliminate the pests, which is how far away? Oh, it's like right there. It looks like. Yeah. So let's um let's check out the shop real quick. Hey, we after this time. Uh, I don't think that's. Yeah, I mean I've pretty much got the best stuff that I can equip right now. Wait. Okay, looks like this one does go up if I give him this different gun. I don't know if I want to spend money on it yet. Um, yeah. See you later. Let's hang tight for now. Um, let's head towards the uh, the quest. Uh, let's go ahead and accomplish the quest. Uh, bring it back. Wow, they got a lot of different stuff here, huh? Actually, yeah, while we're works. here, I almost forgot. While we're here, let's go ahead and turn in the other quest that we did, the hunt uh, quest that we did. Alright, talk to this dude. Talk. So there we go. Alright, achievement unlocked, no first hunt. Got 740 gil and a high elixir. Very nice. <clears throat> Let's, um, okay. Saving. That was about a bite to eat. Don't You're need anything to eat right now. Old. We've got some boosts already. Um,. All right, procurement points have been marked on our map. Oh, that's right. Okay, we've already got that, so we're good there. Um, we want to look at hunt. Want to help out with some varmints? So we've already got varmints of the wasteland. Um, yeah, I'll leave that alone for now. Um, if you all liked it, let's go ahead and do back. the popper one, the main quest line. Come on, go, 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 and sprint. Alright, main quest line is out this way. It's time. Those scorpions. Gladio, come on. Gotcha. 
And we know the scorpions are allergic to, to regular swords. Alright, so let's equip my regular swords. Bam! Alright, there's that. Bam! Oh, block. I should have blocked. Block! <clears throat> Go! Scorpion Barb, nice. That's Warp Strike. And go. Done. Oh, wait. That was one? Oh, okay. Alright, so we've got a few more to do, it looks like. Uh, we still have our boosts on, though, so I can keep sprinting without draining any stamina. So let's head to the second point. <clears throat> Building up some nice experience, too, so the next time we camp... Hopefully, uh, we'll, uh, we'll gain a level or two. We should at least gain one. <clears throat> Alright. Here's the next varmints. Alright. I can't yet. Bam. Oh, I missed. Or something. That was weird. Alright. What I want to do this time, too, is... I want to, uh... I would love to do an actual technique, but I don't know if there's enough of these guys here. Yeah, there isn't. Alright, so that one's already done. It's like by the time I'm done battling these guys, I, um, or by the time I have enough technique built up on the technique bar, or whatever it's called, um, the battle's already done. <laughs> Let's head over here. Are there any procurement points I'm missing along this way? Doesn't look like it, but there is a campsite there, so I'm going to check out that campsite, I think. There's a treasure spot down south. There's a couple camp spots, and then a parking spot. Um, alright. So, uh, where are we headed anyway? Nowhere until the repairs are done. Then we head for Golden Key. Then after that, we hop a boat, and before you know it... I love the random conversation, by the way, in this game. It's really nice. It makes it feel, uh, like a much more organic game. You know, you don't have to prompt somebody to talk to you. You just kind of hear conversation, and even your party mates that you're traveling with, um, you have conversation with as you're traveling, Almost so that's there. really nice. Give it your all. Okay. Oops. Wrong button. Uh, that one. Go. Bam. Go. 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 Ah ha ha, get it, knocked another one out. Oh, I should have blocked, that's okay. Bam, works. Alright. What happened? Okay. Alright, look at that, we've got almost, uh, yeah, over 230 experience, that's awesome. Oh, someone's calling. Interesting. Hello? Hey, it's Cindy. How goes the hunting? Actually, we just finished. That's great, because I got one more hunt for y'all. Only this time, it's for a person. Fella named Dave went off, and we ain't heard from him since. Reckon he staked out a spot in an old shack nearby. Old shack? Oh, got it. We'll take a look. Okay. So, interesting. It looks like we're... What did Cindy say? Needs us to find some Dave guy. He went missing? Not missing. Said he's holed up in that shack. Okay, literally, the name of the, the quest is Hunter Becomes the Hunted. So, I hope that's referring to Dave being the hunter and we're trying to find Dave. Um, but uh, And there's a campsite right next to that, so I guess we'll head there and then we'll do the campsite. Um, but I am going to uh, then end the uh, episode off here, guys, since we're this, I mean, we just finished a piece of, another piece of the main quest line, um, and we're starting off to uh, hunt Dave. So, uh, yeah, guys, I'll catch you next time. I won't postpone this too much longer. Uh, the end of the episodes, uh, the start of the episodes and the end of the episodes, I'll try to make them quicker so that we can fit more of Final Fantasy XV content in each episode. So with that said, guys, like, subscribe to the R&D. As always, stay squirrely. Catch you on the next episode.